What animal has grappling hooks for hands, built-in heat detectors, and are attracted to dry ice? An object of nightmares and a plague to dogs and their humans, ticks are found all over the world. Each tick has to suck blood three times in their life to survive and sometimes transmit diseases in doing so. Ticks spend time in the ground and anytime the temperature is above freezing, crawl up on grasses and low bushes to find a host. As a dog moves through the plants, they drop off the bush and grab onto the host with the grapple hooks on the tip of each leg. All life stages and both sexes feed on blood, burying their heads in the dog's skin. Only adult females become engorged. They feed, then drop off to mate and lay eggs. How do we remove attached ticks? All you need is a small tool called a tick twister or tick key. These are easy to use and prevent the tick from regurgitating fluids that can infect the dog. Slide the twister or key against the skin, positioning the tick in the narrow groove. You might have to try a few times to find the right angle. A quick twist or gentle pull, and the tick comes off with head intact. And then you twist. If the head stays embedded in the skin of its host, it may become infected. Clean the bite with an antiseptic and keep an eye on it for redness or infection. Check with your local veterinary office or the CDC to see what diseases may be carried locally and for advice on what symptoms to watch for. You can submit the live tick to your local veterinary lab or university entomology department if your dog shows signs of illness. Like and subscribe to learn more about dogs.